out of the forest came Dukan. Do you know what Dukan is? If you don't, stick around. Write what you like most about Dukan in the comment below. But to do so, you need to watch the video. Let me take you on that special journey. Vous êtes prêts? C'est parti! Jokan was born in French Guiana in South America. As you can see, French Guiana is located between Suriname and Brazil. What's Jokan? Jokan is an Afro-Amazonian musical martial arts created by Yannick Teolad in 2010. Jokan is a fusion of warrior practices and customs from three groups, the Amerindians, the Bushinengis, and the Creoles of French Guyana. We can see Yannick on the left with some Amerindians from a community called Teko. And on the right, Yannick is with a Bushinenge from a community called Juka. Bushinenge means the black men of the forest. They are the Maroons, descendants of enslaved Africans who escaped from the plantations. Here Yannick is with a Creole in a traditional outfit. Who is Yannick? Teolad. Well, Yannick is first of all the founder of Jokan, also known as Grand Doko Sawanimakan. Grand Doko means Grandmaster. He's also a doctor in musicology and ethnomusicology. And his thesis was on Jokan, which he defended before an international panel of scholars. Yannick is an international expert in martial arts and combat sports and is also a manual therapist. Last but not least, Yannick is a songwriter, composer and musician. Yannick was rewarded with an honorary title, Titre de Noblesse, by the International Federation of Traditional Martial Arts in July 2018. What does the word Jokan mean? Jokan actually comes from Guyanese Creole Jok, which is a word originated from Africa, meaning awakening. So Jokan means the one who has been enlightened or the one who is awake. You may know that French Guiana has various communities and Jokan actually advocates living together. What are the particularities of Jokan? First of all, Jokan has been a Guyanese intangible heritage since October 2011. Jokan has Afro-Amazonian origins and it is the fusion of man and nature. Another particularity is that Jokan works with traditional drums according to a rhythmic code and a very precise musical language. It's worth noting that there's no competition since Jokan is centered around personal development. Therefore, there's no belt, but levels of consciousness based on the elements of nature. Here are the five levels and they are the basic ones, starting with earth, then air, fire, water and man. Jokan has 10 internal disciplines. Let's discover them. The first one. Jubate represents a group of hand combat techniques. Zomyan 
It represents all combat techniques with traditional weapons. You can see here that there's an asterisk showing that he, meaning Yannick, has invented. It's a word which uh, was invented by using Guyanese Creole. So whenever you see an asterisk, it means that Yannick invented the word. Gaia is the exercise of health and wellness. Jaka, bodybuilding exercises which were created by Yannick by observing Amazonian animals. Diloka, it's the art of playing percussion in water. And here again, he invented that word. Dilo is water in Guyanese Creole and Ka is drum. Then we have Sweco, which is for cardiovascular work. Asuwaja, which is a traditional wrestling. Jokano, for traditional rhythms and songs. Garule for self-defense. And Baichak, which is the vital point method. Jokan is open to everyone even the little ones as young as three. So we're going to see the different classes. We have class for the two PT, children aged three and four years. Then you have Timun for those who are five to 12 years old. You have Jenjan for teenagers. You have Mounian for adults. I took this picture from YouTube where you have a video showing those two ladies fighting and I wanted to include this to show you that it's open to everyone including women. Those two ladies are in another video and you can see here that each woman has a machete in her hand and as you know using weapons is part of Jokan as we mentioned earlier. As I said before, Jokan is open to all and Yannick includes everyone. So the seniors would have to go to Grand Moon. Those with disabilities will have to go to Handi Jokan. And there are even classes in prisons. Jokan is not just known in French Ghana, it's also known in other countries, such as Brazil, Suriname, Ecuador, Guadeloupe, Martinique and St. Martin, Canada and the United States, France, England and Spain, Senegal, Burkina Faso and Cameroon, and also La Réunion. What is the future of Jokan? Well, ministries of some countries are interested in integrating Jokan into their schools. So Yannick, good luck. To find out more about Jokan, there's many videos on Jokan on YouTube, like this one showing Yannick and his team at Bercy in France in 2012. So the only thing you need to, know, to do is just to type Jokan on YouTube and you will see all the videos. So I hope that you have found that video very useful and that you've learned something. So please let me know in the comment below and don't forget to like it, share it and of course subscribe to the channel. Au revoir!